we have now arrived at the layer of pelvic peritoneum and fascia. The pelvic peritoneum begins at the level of the anterior abdominal wall, where the parietal peritoneum of that wall meets the parietal peritoneum of the pelvis. It passes above the superior aspect of the urinary bladder and dips inwards on the same superior aspect to form the paravesicular pouches of the peritoneum before it passes behind the bladder to form the uterovesicular pouch in the female and the rectovesicular pouch in the male. The peritoneum continues its journey backwards to cover the anterior aspects of the rectum and plaster that structure to the posterior abdominal wall and the hollow of the pelvis. The endopelvic fascia or pelvic fascia is a condensation which surrounds the organs of the pelvis and their walls. It is covered externally by the parietal peritoneum in areas where the structures are exposed superiorly. It also covers the levator ani muscles which separates the pelvis from the peridium. Below the levator ani is the perineum. Above the levator ani is the lesser pelvis. It contains the following. Pelvic corridor. Pelvic cavity. Pelvic fascia and peritoneum. Sigmoid colon In some in this layer we have exposed the pelvic peritoneum and fascia.